The question that I always ask our clients is, where do you think you can innovate? We think a company has seven different functions, regardless of industry. You can argue with me, I don't care. Maybe you think there's five, maybe you think your industry is different, maybe you think there's eight, I, I don't know. The more important thing than me is, to me is, the, is that you have some rubric by which, the, by which you look at how you create value for your clients and for your customers. Because we tend to get locked into what's the job title, what's a department title, instead of thinking about what is the functional activity that creates value for a client or a customer or a stakeholder. And when we work with clients, we encourage them to go through this exercise and say, okay, let's look at each one of these. Which of these are you great at? Which of these are you not great at? And which are you terrible at? Because the reality is, there is no firm that's great at everything. There's not one. You can come up to me and argue with me, but there's not one firm that's great at all this. And what we more typically find is that people are good at one or two of them, they're okay at three or four, and they're really, really bad. They're killing customer client value with at least one of those. And what you need to do is usually get rid of that thing that you're doing really badly. Find somebody else to do it for you, and the other stuff try to get better and, and get even better at the ones. And when you analyze this, we have questions that we work through with our clients. Like, if you were to take that function by itself and imagine it by itself, how much stakeholder value is created by that function by your firm? How do you manage it? How do you know if you succeeded? And what are total costs for that activity?